As you return back to Camp Price after a patrol in Goreshk City, you are greeted by a rare sight in Afghanistan. The soldiers guarding the gate are neither American, British, Danish nor Afghan. They are Bosnian. There are about 50 of them operating here in Helmand province. And our task is uh, as a force protection unit to protect Camp uh, Base Price. This is the first overseas deployment for these soldiers, who relish the chance to display the professional skills of their fledgling army. Uh, we have this opportunity to, uh, how do I say, to be good in our service, to get ranks, uh, to be... It's a kind of one way to be a professional. And this is the only way because we have these missions and everything to prove ourselves. For me, as a soldier, this is peak of mountain something that I uh, wanted to have in my career and that's something perfect to have uh, almost at the end of my military career. Guarding the camp may not be the most glamorous job in the world, but nevertheless it's vital and impacts upon the operations of their Danish colleagues. Oh, so they're really a, a great bunch, they're doing a, a perfect uh, job uh, with, the, uh, with the guard duties and they have been validated during their, their stay here. And uh, it really means that we can deploy more combat units out in the AO solving other tasks. Having somewhat of a fractured history, the Bosnian soldiers are able to identify with the Afghan people better than most of the ISAF nations. I ask them if the mixed religious beliefs and ethnicities in their contingent ever causes problems. No, 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 we are, as I already said, we are professionals, we, are, we don't have a place for that kind of stuff. We are colleagues and we are soldiers. That's what's important. Actually, I'm very proud of my men. Uh, you know that uh, I have here all of three big uh, Bosnian nations and they've been in a war, they've been fighting each, each other uh, because they are really ex-combatants, mostly of them. But now they are ready to give their lives for each other. That's a very good thing. This is Josh Fortune for the NATO channel, Helmand, Afghanistan.